Hi guys, welcome back to the Acne Channel. I'm Felicia and today we'll be debunking the top skincare acne myths. So let's get into it. The first one we'll be talking about is that the reason why I had acne in high school and college was because I did not wash my face enough. The reason why that myth is false is because acne can be caused by so many things. People would be like, do you not wash your face? Personally, when I heard that, I overcompensated with washing my face. I used the harshest cleanser that I could find. It caused more inflammation and more breakouts. So then I'm thinking, well, I'm washing my face vigorously, and constantly, so why do I still have acne? And in my case, back in high school, it was caused by my hormonal changes. So another reason why not washing your face enough is a myth. I was cleansing my face really hard. And it was to the point where I thought my skin type was oily. I would spend hours looking for the best mattifying primers, best mattifying um, setting sprays, best mattifying foundations, you know? And it just wasn't mattifying enough because I was just so oily. So I went to my dermatologist and I said, you know, can you recommend anything that would mattify my skin? She asked me, well, what are you, what products are you using? I listed like the boom, 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 <laughs> like the strongest products that I could find for my acne. And she was silent and she said, I don't think your skin is actually oily. I think that you're using a lot of harsh products that are stripping your natural oils and your skin is overcompensating and producing more oils. You are irritating your skin so much and cleansing your skin so much that you are, you know, aggravating your skin and increasing your acne. And that just blew my mind and that was kind of you know the reality check you can cleanse and you know wash your face all you want and you can still have acne so the second myth is that makeup causes acne. I've heard that multiple times. Well, it's because you, you're wearing makeup. You know, there was a point where I said, okay, so maybe it is the makeup. So I wasn't wearing makeup for months. I mean, months I wasn't wearing makeup because I thought, okay, maybe makeup causes my acne. Makeup can definitely cause irritation on the skin, especially if you don't clean your face well enough after wearing makeup. It can definitely clog your pores and contribute and worsen your acne but it doesn't specifically cause acne another myth that we'll be talking about is that your acne will just magically go away people tell me that all the time oh just wait your acne will go away and in my case it didn't just magically go away. I had to do a lot of research and I had to change up my skincare routine and I had to change what I ate. And you know, I actually took a skin allergy patch test where they put a patch over the skin on my back and you know, checked for irritation in the next like, I think like two or three days. Like I had to do that to avoid products that I use or stop using. And I also had to cut off dairy. So it is our job, our personal job to educate ourselves. Acne can be caused by so many things. There's just not one thing. Another myth is that going out in the sun will treat acne that one is actually dangerous. And that's, again, something that I believed. I spent years, years experimenting with my face and believing all these myths and just to find out that they're not true. So I'm here to tell you, the sun is not a treatment for acne. And the first time, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll admit the first time I believed it because when I got darker, so it wasn't like the acne wasn't really as visible. And it, it did dry some of the acne, like it turned into whiteheads. And I remember thinking, oh my gosh, it works. But let me tell you, it is false. It is false because, because it is not worth the 
risk of skin cancer. It is not worth the risk of skin damage from the UVA rays. It's not a, a sustainable treatment for acne. A better solution would be using those face masks that have those light therapy face masks. Those are better options, safer options than just laying in the sun and just soaking up all of the UVA and the UVB rays. So the last myth we're gonna talk about is that all acne is caused by bacteria. Not true not true i mentioned there are just so many different causes for acne your body is very complex your skin is the largest organ in your body it is so complex you know like i mentioned in high school it was due to hormonal changes right going to puberty you know dealing with stress stress is a huge one for me i had to also take spironolactone um, because of my hormonal acne that was caused by hormones right not just the bacteria all right so that is all i have for you guys those are the top myths um, about skincare and acne that i've heard personally and i hope that this video is helpful as usual and that you subscribe to the acne channel for more of these videos thank you again so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye